so hello guys today i'm going to show you how you can install the best fusion 3.3.0 so yeah thank you for reaching 1000 views in my previous video for the demo how you can swap the face using the face fusion 3.2.0 uh, uh, a new version has been updated in this site as you can see we can already download page 3.3.0 so in today's video i will show you how you can install it so first of all you need to go to this site github yeah there you can find the files necessary files and also how you can install so uh, it can be installed in two ways by using uh, as i said in my earlier video that you can also install <coughs> using using the uh, command prompt or you can also install using the windows installer or mac uh, mac os installer as required so uh, first of all i will show you how you can install using the command prompt so for that you need to install uh, anaconda uh, python distribution so you just have to go here i will uh, post the link in the description make sure to visit the description as well so you need to download it and it will be started downloading so it's a, a, a bigger size with uh, and it depends on your internet speed so just wait and get it in uh, downloaded then you can install it so <coughs> so I'll meet you after I I get uh, downloaded So it's already downloaded as you can see here I'm gonna open this so it will see as you can see you can run this and then a pop-up dialog will be opened so this have to it's a regular install Let's hit next. This is next. Mm, I don't know the path environmental. Yes. Okay, uh, something completion. Okay. And then just in a in few seconds, it will be installed. And account the package will be installed in your computer. It will take few minutes just wait it has not been froze it is just taking its time for its installation so just be patient so after the installation as you can see it is completed so just hit next hit next and just uncheck this and just finish so the download has been completed and after that you just need to see conda here conda for the conda console uh, yeah so anaconda prompt and as you can see the conda prompt will be here so <coughs> after the installation of anaconda prompt so you need you just need to hit some commands for the installation now I will show what you need to install so first of all you need to install the uh, git so just uh, type these and just hit inst uh, enter so make sure you have enough space for the installation as it will take a lot of space so do you know terms press Y and then enter And it will copy and it will copy the git and install the git from the link so it did say that uh, the it has been successfully downloaded and it will be installing
so it's almost installed and yeah so the git has already installed next you need to install the mini conda just hit this prompt and this and then press enter and then Okay, so it's on a found mini conda version 3 by as you can as we've already installed the anaconda so it is creating a copy of it and then installing so okay downloading repo anaconda.com so starting the package install hit next are you agree just me or you can also choose all users if you have multiple users where you need to just click on install then it will be installing mini conda and it will say, take some time as previous so as you can see I've successfully installed a mini conda 3 as well hit next now we don't need to run it so it has also been installed so next step is to install the ffmpeg for merging and uh, the uh, distributed v uh, photos to videos so for that you need to enter this command at same or it won't be installed so just pause the video copy your uh, uh, hit this command on your screen and this press enter then it will be downloading the ffmpeg as you can see the process is still on progress it will also take some time so it's basically downloading and installing uh, certain tools for the process so just be patient and you will be successfully installing just don't skip these steps if you skip any one of the step then your face fusion won't be uh, running properly okay you won't be swapping any photos or videos so after this so after successfully installing the uh, FFmpeg you need to create your uh, environment in your Python so conda init does does all uh, modified as you can see it has been modified Then you need to create an environment in your Python as you can see. Uh, three times accepted collecting packages. So, our uh, uh, environment named Face Fusion will be created. So, just wait some um, time. So, it's being loaded as you can see. So to hit the prompt, just press Y to proceed and then it will be downloading some packages for the installation process and then done. Verifying transactions, executing transactions and it will also be done in a few seconds. Yeah. So to activate use conda activate to deactivate just use conda deactivate so we'll be going to conda activate face fusion and then the, as you can see it's base here now it's face fusion so we we are on face fusion environment after that you need to copy the installation file from the git so just hit this git clone http this link and press enter then it will go in like this and it will be copied after that you just need to go to the face fusion where it has been copied and then for the installation just hit python install.py or next one the default then it will yeah, download the necessary files for the installation and collect the packages will take some time just wait some minutes and 
the installation has been started. So if you ever see this frozen like image then it's not frozen it's getting uh, information and downloading the resources needed for the installation so just be so have some patience go eat some snacks or have some uh, workout it will get installed within few minutes as you can see it started already So as you can see if there are some uh, already installed resource and then it will be installed and then uh, try to install the correct version needed for the phase fusion app. It's very easy as you can see once you get hang of it you won't be face any problems. So if you have any problems regarding the process I have told already you can always comment down below the error or the problem you're facing and i can easily reply with you the solution so, so there's just some walk around here so it's downloading and install the numpy 2.2.4 mm, now it's on x so yeah successfully uninstalled 2.2.4 so as you can see here it's it actually first installed the 2.2.4 then uh, downloaded ONX this one so since it's not compatible with uh, uh, NumPy 2.2.2 2.2.4 then it's again started installing 2.3.24 ONX 1.17.0 okay so it will install and uninstall based on the requirement so you just need to see what it's installing to get hang of it let's just wait a few more minutes okay so I'll show you the screen when it's done already okay so after successfully installing the face fusion with your command prompt so now you need to uh, deactivate so I haven't activated it yet. Okay, so let's see. So what you need to do is to restart your face fusion environment. So just type conda deactivate. It will deactivate the environment and again activate. So conda activate face fusion, right? on the activate face fusion and then it will run. so after active reactivating the conda environment face fusion environment you need to go to the correct path where you've downloaded the face fusion so i've downloaded for that change directory to so i think i guess my file sign documents pps and face fusion i guess oh yeah so since I am in the correct folder where my face fusion was installed, then I would uh, type Python 
facefusion.py which is actually the run file name so i will hit run and it will the command will run and then a link will be available where uh, which is the virtual ip address where our face fusion runs so as you can see this so just copy this link and hit on your browser and then you're ready to go as you can see face swapper face enhancer so in this way you can install the face fusion app thank you thank you this is much for today's lessons so don't forget to hit the like hit share and don't forget to subscribe for more informative video and installation of different tools AI tools regarding the face swapping so thank you guys have a good day